welcome back friends uh, in this video tutorial I'm going to talk about the mechanism of uh, the cross uh, between F plus and F minus type of plasmid uh, containing bacterial cell now we previously talked about the F plus type F plus plasmids mean uh, they are the F plus type of bacterial cell mean they carry the fertility plasmid with them now the importance of fertility plasmid is that they can provide you uh, uh, let me take first okay they can uh, provide you the important necessary ingredients uh, which are really really needed for the conjugation purposes uh, okay okay now uh, for example if you have a bacterial cell now that bacterial cell uh, must have uh, the bacterial chromosome but instead uh, and an the outsource of the bacterial chromosome uh, if there is another plasmid which is having the origin of transfer site which is already T and also can provide uh, the cell uh, with many different uh, type of protein production which is helping them to produce that pili that means uh, if you have one bacterial cell here it can produce this sex tunnel through which the DNA material can be passed to another bacterial cell which is the recipient okay now in this kind of mechanism of a uh, cross what do you mean by cross in this case uh, this is not the way uh, how classical geneticist actually uses the term but now the cross term in this case initiated uh, because of uh, the, the mode of transfer of the genetic element between two bacterial cell one is the donor another one is the recipient so the transfer mode of gene between these two are called the cross or uh, in between these two right so let us first think about uh, this cross uh, so what what happens in the very first step is the pair formation so the donor cell here it is uh, the F plus plasmid which is having this extra chromosomal DNA which is having the fertility factor but on another hand we are having the recipient cell which is not having any fertility factor it is only having its chromosomal DNA here now uh, uh, for this purpose the very first step is the pair formation between these two cells one is the donor another one is the recipient now uh, for the importance of this pair formation uh, the proteins which are needed for making this pair is provided by the F plus cell or the donor cell because donor cell is carrying the F fertility plasmid it can produces all the pilin proteins and all these things which can make uh, the pili uh, from this F plus pl plasmid containing cells okay now uh, after the pair formation the second step come in which is called the DNA transfer now in this DNA transfer stage what happens uh, there is a uh, special place in this uh, there is a special place here which is called the ODT origin of transfer from where the DNA strand is, uh, is cut and then the DNA strand is uptaken into another cell with the help of the protein called relaxes if you want to see the mechanism in, in detailed manner you can uh, go and watch for other videos in my YouTube channel okay so they will uptake this uh, strand right after the uptake uh, what happens right after the uptake will end up with two different cells a donor which is previously having the F plasmid is still having that F but the recipient which was previously F minus that means which are uh, which is uh, not having any uh, fertility plasmid right after this conjugation event it receives the fertility plasmid copy from the F plus donor so as a result after the end of this conjugation what we have end up with we end up with both F plus type of plasmid containing cell so first is uh, the starting at the beginning we are F plus and F minus right after the transfer we end up with F plus and F plus now another important thing you must uh, notice in this uh, process is that the DNA which is the extra chromosomal inheritance uh, here uh, which is uh, transferred from one cell to another cell is uh, not incorporated with the chromosomal DNA so the extra chromosomal DNA is uh, nothing to do with the chromosomal DNA in all these cases okay so in this case that is another important thing so the cross between F plus and F minus never deals with the shuffling of the chromosomal and non chromosomal DNA so the chromosomal DNA remains as it is but the extra chromosomal DNA which is the F factor is transferred from one cell to another cell okay so that's it and I hope it will help you thank you